So, um, as you guys may have noticed, I, um, I got a game PC. I mean, you probably did not notice that because I made exactly zero announcement about it, other than the fact that I probably texted it in a, a group chat with, like, a few of my friends, I think. And all that types of stuff. So... Uh, okay, just ignore the fact that I burped right there. You've probably been wondering what I have been doing with my game PC. And, um... Well, I wouldn't say I've been doing a lot with it, but... You'd probably be thinking, like, oh, well, Mr. Druid Gaming is probably, like, pogging it up on his gaming PC, right? You know, he's probably playing that, you know, the CSGO or whatever the frick, you know, the freaking gaming PC player's playing. He's probably playing those Neptunia games, you know, trying to pog it up or trying to nip, 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 nip. I don't know. But that's not the case. Actually, technically, it is because I have played... Um, at least two of the Neptunian games I wanted to play that were not on any of the consoles, but instead, I am doing this as you see right here. Hi. It's me, Neptune. Oh my gosh, okay, so, I got a game PC, right? This is actually one of the things I've always wanted to do, is to kind of just, uh, mess around with, um, this, uh, this, just, just this in general. <laughs> you know, I thought it'd be really funny. I thought it'd be really, really, you know, I don't know, actually. I just, I just thought it'd be really funny. Maybe it is funny to you guys. I don't know. But I think I'm not the person to judge on whether you think it's funny or not, because I am Neptune after all. I do like pudding. Feed me pudding now. Or also eat you. I am Neptune after all. I have a big mouth. You see all these l interesting little faces I'm making? You see how... <laughs> you see how, like, interesting it is? It's like... <laughs> I don't know, I just think they're really funny. Hello, I'm- I'm Neptune's sister, and, um, um, uh... You know what, this lip sync thing is actually kind of bad now that I re-look at it. I don't know, I just- I just thought it would look- I don't know, it's just like... Huh. Huh. When I turn it off, right, you, you, every time I open my mouth, you, you can't even see my mouth open, right? Right? Like, my mouth is not that animated for some reason, so, if I don't have it on, it's not gonna be looking as janky as this, but, hey, at least my mouth is forming something. At least it sounds like I'm actually talking. Unlike when I'm just like... <laughs> but, you know, if I have this on, then you can actually, you know... Everything. Oh my gosh, I look so freaky. Look at me. Look at me. <gasps> look at me. Okay, hey guys, so can I talk to you about this one hilarious story? It was actually very, very, very funny. So one time, right? Um. <coughs> oh my gosh. I tried, I tried moving my mouth and that hurt so much. I choked on my own spit. Here you get that feeling when you choke on your own spit. That's one embarrassing moment you just saw of me, Miss Neptune, choking on her own spit. Not wonderful. Anyways, so this is one time the Noir got stuck in a pipe. It was very interesting. I don't remember which game it was. It was probably not even in a game at all, but she got stuck in a pipe. It was pretty funny. There's also those other times where me and Nepgear landed on her. Because she was always just existing there, you know? Because every time she was just existing in that one spot, she just... Hey, at least she got some cakes. On her back. Yeah, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Okay, well, uh, since, uh, I, Numar, 
the woman that totally did not get stuck in the pipe or anything. Um, anyways, uh, since because we're going to talk about embarrassing stories, I might as well talk about one. It's, it wasn't that embarrassing, but it was one where it almost cost a Neptune's life. Because I was just that angry with her. Actually, no. Not just me. Every single one of us. Except for Nepgear, of course. Because Nepgear is so sweet. And personally, everyone loves Nepgear. Even I do. I don't even know Nepgear that well. Anyways, so, um, one time, right, uh, what was it, uh, I don't remember what day it was, but Neptune decided, hey, so, I'm gonna release this video with me and Nepgear, and, um, it's gonna, it's gonna be, you know, just me and some idols and such, and it's gonna be so incredible, and everyone's gonna love us, and then, um, you know, because it actually worked, uh, we had to do something about that, and it, it, it just, it just, it just wasn't great. We, we needed to do something about that, and, you know, if, if, if we didn't, then, like, I would've killed her. I mean, I'm not afraid to do so, because she gets really frustrating. Oh, but, but then if I kill her, who the heck is supposed to annoy me? Like, what do I think about it? Oh my gosh. <sighs> Are we talking about embarrassing stories of old good sweet Neptune that no one likes. Oh, that's wonderful. Because I got one of my own I know happened to Neptune. She doesn't like to admit it, but it was quite embarrassing, I must say. One time, right, um, we went to an amusement park. She took me there. I don't like to admit it, because I don't like going to amusement parks that much, but um, anyways, um, Neptune took me there, and um, she decided, hey, so you want to go on this little, um, she didn't really describe it that well, but it was like a Ferris wheel. So she wanted to go on that, right? And, um, she, <laughs> okay, when I, when I look back on it, it was kind of funny, but, um, when I think about it, um, she, she, she went on it and <laughs> she, <laughs> I'm not the type to kind of giggle a lot, but I, I'm sorry. This was when when something like that happens. And, okay, let me explain. So Neptune gets on the Ferris wheel, right? And um, she she decides, okay, so I'm gonna climb out, right? I'm gonna look really cool. I'm gonna go on the top of the Ferris wheel, even though it's like a hundred feet big. So she she went on it, right? And um, okay, it, it's not that funny if it was someone else, but she fell. She fell before she even got the first step onto the, the <laughs> she fell before she even got on the first step on the, uh, the, <laughs> the, I can't, I can't even come. She fell. She, she fell. That's all you need to know. She fell. You can just, just, you can, you can picture how she fell, but she fell. And I hate saying it, but it was so funny. Though it was just the way that she fell. It's so indescribable. <laughs> no matter how many novels I read, I don't think I can ever describe a fall like Neptune's. The best I can describe it as, she got hit by like the few of the other arms. Only two times though. She may have gotten a migraine after that, but you know. <laughs> I think that's what she gets for being overly frustrating. Embarrassing stories about Neptune. Oh, well, um, I don't really have an embarrassing story on my own, but there was that one time when I, I couldn't, I couldn't really, like, just... Every time I think about it, it was like... Anyways, so, one time, right, I was playing Four Goddesses, the third game. However you call the sequel of the third game. It's probably called a threequel, as maybe everyone might say, but... As you may all know, Neptune came bursting into my room, like she always does, by the way. And, um, when she did... She decided, hey Vert, so um, there is this one other place I wanted to go to. It has this monster, and I think he stole your spear. But, when I kind of, I guess you could say when I kind of um, decided to um, even get up a bit, she decided to come rushing to me, and for some reason, she knocked over everything. She thought it was funny too. That's what I thought was, that's what, that's what made me really upset. She thought it was funny. She knocked over every single one of my computer cords that I, you know, that I, uh, 
that he had set up. And, uh... I cannot tell you how frustrated I was. I... She was lucky that I was unequipped during that... During the time. She could have died. And not by the computer cords either. Well, hey, excuse me, but, you know, I am the main protagonist after all, and it's not, it's not very nice talking about, you know, mean stuff about me. I mean, after all, I got the, I got the brightest smile you have ever seen. You'll never see anyone with the greatest smile like I do, because, you know, I mean, if Noir did, then simply put, it would look so ridiculous. I'm not gonna front. It would look very funny if she had the most... Interesting small ever. Okay, so, um, I wanted this to be short. I didn't want this to be too long. I probably even went on longer than I wanted to, but, um, I just, I just wanted to do this because I thought it was funny. And, uh, literally nothing more than that. So if you guys enjoy watching this video, maybe you guys for whatever reason want me to do this, uh, <laughs> Give it a like, and share the video, and subscribe to the channel. I promise you, I, I promise you, you won't get any of this cringy type of content anymore. I, I'll do everything I can to make sure that the rest of my content is not as cringy as this. I might actually die looking at my own video, so, you know. I'll see you guys whatever you do next. Take care. God bless you guys. And because I am a CPU candidate, may I bless you.